where you were uh, at Sun, but you've done a great job stewarding Java forward, moving us into the open source world, and we appreciate all that you've done. And uh, again, I think uh, he deserves a huge round of applause. For all of so, so we've got a little, a little video. What is he? A long time ago, Bill Joy told me this was the greatest programmer ever. And he so, was wrong. I know who the greatest programmer is. Hey, do you? Who is it? So we hired Deutsch. Oh, well, can we hire him? We did. Did we? Good. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> he decided after a while he didn't want a day job. Okay. Well, anyhow, so the, the early days, I, I called James and I said, go do whatever you want to go do. And we have a little video that kind of recaptures yeah. some of the, uh, the olden days here. No, oh, that's terrible. Well, let's see. We started as a group of kind of disgruntled engineers. Kind of thought that there were directions that computing could go that most people in the computer industry weren't thinking of. Scott was great. Give us some space. Let us go off and rent this convenient spot behind the green door. And then we started really gravitating towards all this consumer electronics stuff. You know, pretty much everything that's kind of mechanical and people touched was getting a brain in it. So we decided to build this prototype that was all about sort of control of consumer electronics devices. And we built this really cool gizmo thing called the Star 7. And my part of the Star 7 project was to deal with a bunch of the software engineering issues. You know, the solution to the software engineering problem became the thing that we now call Java. So we just picked up our toys and did it all on, on the internet. Came up with a web browser that, that did things that nobody had ever seen before. And we were getting pretty excited about it. We had a really great time at this TED conference. Really split a lot of heads around. Then we get to Sunworld and you know the only thing that the press wanted to talk to us about was was Java, 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 Java. And we had this, oh my god moment. You know, there's only a couple of dozen of us working on it at the time. And the only way we could get it out there was to open it up. So when we opened up Java and gave Java to the world, then just watched the world drag Java into just the most amazing place. Some of them that we had kind of thought of, and many of them that had never occurred to us. Yeah, we gave Java to the world, and you know, the rest is history. Mostly out of trouble here on stage. 
before you bought or thought about buying Sun or whatever, did, did, did Oracle even have a clue about Java? Did you know about Java? Were you aware of Java? Well, I, I had read about it in the paper. Okay, good. <laughs> Some of my friends spoke about it. I wasn't sure what they were talking about. Ser to be serious for a moment, uh, Oracle, uh, Oracle's middleware strategy is based 100% on Java. So, uh, I mean, Java was a very attractive platform for us because it was open and it allowed us uh, to extend the platform. Just like you're able to extend the platform and build applications on top of it, we did the same thing. And, our whole next generation of business applications, something we call a fusion suite of applications, is built entirely on Java. Now, this will be the first ever set of ERP. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, guys, hang on, hang on. So, hang on, hang on, stop. Whoa, 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 time out. So, you may have heard me say, you know, he or she who dies with the most toys wins, but that's already he won that one. So it's kind of hard, kind of hard for a guy who's won everything. But he does like boats. So what we thought we would do is give him a little decoration for the Rising Sun and for the America's Cup boat. So what we have here is a little uh, nautical representation. Let me you grab, you grab that other end, Larry. You grab the other end here, right there. And for those, do you, do you know what that says there? Can you read that? You know, I, I'm not good at reading the signal. I know these are standard signal flags, uh, but I'm not sure. J A V A. There you go. So. <laughs>